answers. TV6 Investigates. First at 6 o'clock tonight, Iowa is home to some of the most valuable farmland in the world. But in Scott County, it's worth a little bit less this year. Thanks for being with us tonight. I'm Redrick Terry. Morgan is off. That information comes from Iowa State University's annual farmland value survey. It collects information about farm values in all 99 Iowa counties. And this year, Scott County saw the biggest decline. TV6 Investigates Matt Christensen read that report and joins us now. Matt, is this a reason to worry? Now, experts say probably not. This is low interest rates, COVID money sent to farmers, and high farm incomes all combined to drive land values to record levels the past two years. But interest rates are back down, are back up, the COVID money has run out, and that leaves farmers with less money to buy new land. We're seeing a decline, but it's not a plummet. Rabil Shandio heads the report. So I personally expect that we'll see a slower land market, but uh, I don't think we should see any uh, crashes in the land values, kind of the, the, kind of the ones we saw in, in the 80s. Uh, it, it might be more of more of a market adjustment like the one we saw in 2015, 16, and like the, the last decade. Now, Scott County farmland is valued at an average of fifteen thousand three hundred thirty-eight dollars an acre in 2023, and that's down six hundred and thirty dollars an acre from last year's report. Um, the reason we're seeing a slight decline in, in in a few counties in these regions is because these were the counties that experienced very very high increases in the last couple of years. We had an overall surge uh, at 29% in 21 and then 17% in 2022. But now we're trying to, we're, we're coming back where the land market is slowing down and the pace of increase is slowing overall. Shandio said the number one factor driving real estate value still is location. Some buyers are still willing, willing to pay top dollar for the right piece of land. I found one farm near West Locust Street in Davenport that's listed at more than $20,000 an acre. Wow. All right, Matt. Thank you. Now, TV6 Investigates has more data on land values and farm trends. You can check out our news app or website for a closer look.